Hi, Anthony from Retail Edge. We understand in today's day and age that information is important. One of the many things we tout about Retail Edge is the level of information that the program puts in your fingertips. But not everyone in your business needs access to all that information. Today, we're going to go over planning, setting up security in Retail Edge. I like to start this process by running a report. Go to Reports, Miscellaneous, and Action List. When the report runs, notice that there's a description and level. Speaking of levels, that's how you would be able to restrict certain areas of the program from your clerks. Take notice of the column next to the description. We use a numeric system of 0 through 99 to restrict access to action list items. For example, if I set up clerk A with an action list of level 20, they will only be able to perform tasks in this report from 0 to level 20 but not anything from 21 through 99. This is why planning out your security structure before implementing it is important. We have predefined a structure of 20 for clerks, 40 trusted clerks, 60 supervisors, 80 managers, 99 is the admin owner level access. What I suggest is looking over this report, coming up with how you want to categorize your clerks. For example, after reviewing this report, you would like your clerks to perform most tasks that are set to level 40 managers and supervisors at level 80, with the exceptions of a few action list items. Take note of the action list items that you would like to move out of or into the clerk's range as well as the supervisors. The levels are adjustable. Don't worry, I'll show you how to do that in another video though. In our next video, we're going to go over creating clerks, assigning them action list levels, and for you multi-location businesses, assigning them permissions on a location basis. Well, I hope you found this information useful. And if you would like more information, you can visit us at retailedge.com. And if you like the content we're putting up, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. Have a good day.